Before we launch, I want you to take a good look around. It's beautiful here, don't you think? Now, you may not recognise it, but take my word for it, this is your home. Here we go. Take off in three, two, one. Are you still with me? We're now 300 metres above sea level and climbing. Have a look around. It might not look like the place you consider home, but give it another minute. You're now 100 kilometres above sea level and officially in space. Let's find a good place to stop. Take a deep breath and look at where you've come from. Do you recognise it now? You can no longer see the lake, the beautiful trees or the green, green grass. But now you see why it's all part of the place that is our home. This amazing planet we all share. Looking at the Earth from space made me realise the interconnectedness between everything and everyone on that tiny, fragile and precious blue dot. I realised that despite our differences, we are all in the same boat or spaceship. I felt a sense of responsibility towards our home, to the life and lives it supports. This feeling has stayed with me ever since. Among astronauts, like me, we call this feeling the overview effect. Just take a moment to let it all sink in before you start your journey back home. Look at the northern lights and the galaxy behind. And do you see that thin blue line surrounding our incredible planet? That's the atmosphere and it has sustained all life on Earth for millions of years. Earth is an extraordinary place. But lately, our way of life has become a threat to the very home we depend on. We have upset the balance within our environment and caused the climate to change. We need to take responsibility, not just for causing it, but for fixing it. Because it's not enough just to love our home. We need action. Let's go back. Thank you for taking the time to see the world, our home, from my point of view. I'll be quiet now and leave you here to enjoy the sunset. This is Helen Sharman, signing off 